I grew up in Hilltop. So I grew up in this area and I understand the challenges of our communities in this area in Pierce County. See in our community so much homelessness, so much uh, disproportionate impact uh, involved in other systems. And, and we know from the research that our providers can have a 60% uh, impact in the lives of those we serve. And Associate Ministries, they really get that. Um, they try to hire employees that really reflect the diversity of the clients they serve. I was homeless myself. Um, I was on drugs for three years. It was a really hard time for me. I didn't have a lot of support. My family and friends kind of all turned their backs on me. So I kind of understand when clients come in and they don't have support and they don't know how to go about getting back on their feet and really you know, doing things on their own. Like, I had to get out of it on my own. We don't look at the client's barriers when they come to us or the limitation. We don't go into their past, their history, their criminal records, their whatever barriers they have. Um, we don't really, we don't touch that. We talk about what's going on right now. What do you need right now? Um, and we, we talk to them and try to pull out their strengths and help them see their strengths. When I came through these doors and I saw what Associated Ministries was doing, and maybe more importantly, who was doing it and the passion that they had for it, I was instantly galvanized that people aren't in the organization, people are the organization. Associated Ministries was particularly accommodating for us and making it possible for us to be involved in a way that we wouldn't be otherwise. I mean, I grew up in a rural area in Iowa, for goodness sake, and for me to take on the hilltop wasn't <laughs> anything that was in, in my uh, bones, you see. But Associated Ministries made it possible for, you know, an old country boy, uh, uh, for me to be involved in the inner city in a way in which I, I could be effective. Love is action. You could tell a person, I love you all day, but if you don't show action, there's no weight. That's just like pouring water in a bucket with no bottom. It's, you have no substance. And there's too many people walking around with no substance. And that's what I, I enjoy about social ministries. You can see the results in which they are participated in this community. You know, most of the rest of the world looks at a rose and says, how come such a beautiful flower has to have so many thorns on it. And the folks at Associated Ministries really take a look at it and say, you know what, isn't it wonderful that a thorn bush has such beautiful roses? And that attitude, that understanding, that sort of transformational way of looking at the world really does act as a guiding principle for who we are inside the organization. We really do look at all of the challenges that are out there as opportunities. Um, and we really look at the positive side of what we can be doing to strengthen that community because it's only a, that understanding, the positive of the community and what we have as potential, that we're really ever going to achieve anything.